Hey everybody, I know it's been a long time, but welcome back to Kane's Race Team. A lot has happened since our last episode, so let's try to catch up today. Let's see. So we went from renting carts at Unser to buying an older cart chassis and building a racing machine from the bottom up. Then we spent months gathering parts and safety equipment like my suit, helmet, and armadillo. It took some months of work and renting this makeshift studio shop, but now we're ready to race. I just had my first ever race with the Colorado Karting Tour last weekend, qualified third and taking fourth place overall. I got so close to the podium, but I was definitely the fastest rookie on the grid that day. I broke my personal lap record at IMRI Motorsports Park with a 106.6, also the second fastest lap in my class, so I'm proud of my first race. The first points race of the season is next weekend, so I'll have to get some practice at Action Karting before then. I've never been to that track before, so it will be a challenge. My goal is to be a rookie champion this year. My competition is fast and more experienced, so it won't be easy. Well, who wants to do stuff that's easy? We made a few videos over the months showing the build process and some highlights of my driving experiences at the track. I'll leave some links at the end of the video so you can check it out. This is my racing cart. I was lucky enough to get this machine from last year's Junior 1 class champion, the amazing Nolan Payne who also holds that track record I've been chasing at Unser Karting in Denver since last year. By the way, I'm third fastest at that track now, but I haven't been there in a long time to challenge for the top spot. Soon. My dad designed and printed my stickers and I couldn't be happier with how it looks. Shout out to the Colorado Carter, the best local resource for everything karting, from racer interviews to classifieds, a guide for new carters, and all the latest news about the karting world. Check out thecoloradocarter.com. Here's my engine. It's a Briggs L206 204cc four-stroke racing motor. At full power, this thing puts out almost nine horsepower. It maxes out around 6,000 RPM. I'm in the cadet class for my rookie year, so that means I'm driving with a green throttle slide restrictor to limit the output of this engine. But I'm hoping to move up to Junior One next year and run the unrestricted black slide. I just want to go fast. I'll be taking some group classes soon with my driving instructor, Eric Gunnarsson of Apex Predator Driver Development. It'll be great experience and a lot of fun to chase him and the other cadets around to build our speed and skill on the track. We'll get to walk the track at SBR Motorsports Park and learn about its racing line, apexes, and braking zones. Then we do a lead follow session with Eric and his cart, running practice, and passing drills. Then my dad gets to learn more about chassis setup and adjustments, tire strategies, and brakes tuning and maintenance to make my cart faster for race day. We also get to learn about using a Micron for driver data collection so I can work on any hidden weak points in my technique. Contact Eric Gunderson at the Colorado Carter at gmail.com for the best driver and team instruction there is. Now that we're in the groove and finally going racing, we'll be updating this channel more often with videos about me, the technical stuff, and carting in general. Make sure you hit that subscribe button to follow along. And if you like what you see, let the YouTubes know by hitting the like button. It helps me a lot. Thanks so much for watching. This episode was brought to you by Apex Predator Driver Development. Became my life. You took me.